hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel Tifain Waisia. so if you're new welcome and uh, please do remember to subscribe and join the family for my premier gang welcome you know i love you all so on today's video it will be all about spend the day with us i'll share with you guys a new recipe i'll show a small shopping haul uh, get ready with us and uh, how our dinner date went so i hope you stay tuned and uh, enjoy the video so for those who don't know me i'm a kenyan uh, youtuber and content creator i love being a wife and uh, the best job so far for me is being a mom nothing tops that for me enjoying creating content on lifestyle uh, relationships uh, like marriage uh, cooking i love love cooking especially for my family and apart from that i love organizational videos cleaning and uh, beauty videos so what really motivates me is the support i get from my family the immense feedback and love i get from my fans and generally i just love doing this introducing uh wanda Shia filmora i know you've heard about this in one of my previous uh, videos so it's an easy to use uh, video editing software with powerful functions and uh, everyone can start uh, with filmora very easily and quickly even with zero editing skills so one of the things i love about it is because it has tons of uh, built-in templates such as uh, text overlays filters which can help you edit the video quality and so much more so wondershare filmora is more budget friendly compared to other editing softwares and guess what you guys it has a free trial you can try it out this video is uh, powered by filmora check out the share the spotlight campaign to highlight the black talent and raise funds for black creatives so this is us getting up and uh, hubby is always always on his calls especially when he's home so i start off by taking some water so that at least i can wake up well and then i'll leave hubby in bed so that he can go and start preparing a breakfast i don't do much i just go to the bathroom and uh, maybe wash my hands my face and then i go straight uh, to the kitchen So by this time Ivana had already woken up and she was taking her breakfast. So yes, uh, this is me going straight uh, into the kitchen to start uh, making a uh, breakfast. And I started off by making myself some coffee because I really needed that uh, energy. So that's what I'm doing here. Let me feel your love again 
just the two of us and we could stay up all night kissing under street lights doing what we want to doing what we need to do staying up all night everything is all So what I'll be making, uh, the ingredients will be three eggs, one cup of milk, uh, two scoops of uh, margarine, and uh, three tablespoons of uh, sugar. I added a teaspoon of uh, vanilla essence and uh, one teaspoon of uh, baking powder. So the process is uh, quite simple. I'll just be mixing everything. I started off by beating the eggs and then I went on to combine uh, the margarine with uh, sugar. So I did not have my electric uh, mixer that could have made things very easy. It was uh, spoiled by this. I don't know what happened. I think it overheat or something. So I was just using the normal hand mixer, but it just works the same. It just takes a little more time to mix everything up. But if you don't have the electric mix mixer, this hand mixer will just do the same. So beat it up until it has this consistency because this will ensure that uh, what you're making is uh, super soft and uh, we want that. So there is the sandwich maker that I'll be using. And uh, yes, I'll now combine uh, the sugar and uh, margarine the eggs and then mix everything up well. And then I'll proceed to add my flour and um, uh, baking powder, salt and vanilla essence. So this is the consistency we want. You want it to be smooth and runny like this. So make sure you beat it well. So now I'll uh, heat up my sandwich maker for like about two or uh, one minute or so until it is hot enough. And then I'll uh, sprinkle some oil. Don't forget to do that part. Sprinkle some oil and then uh, proceed to put your butter for it to cook. So it will cook for about uh, three minutes or so. It's so fast. It cooks very fast. So it will cook for about uh, three minutes or be just checking because you can always just open the sandwich maker to see if it's brown or it has turned in the brown color. Then you'll know it has cooked. So yes, uh, make sure the butter is not too much because it will... Uh, uh, spill over so we don't want that so just put enough then uh, you spread it out like that and then uh, the sandwich maker will just do the rest it will separate your butter and make this awesome awesome breakfast or snack so hubby was just waiting for the first one to cook and uh, yes he was very impatient uh, by this time 
and uh, yes uh, we were still waiting for it to cool So it turned out so great. You can see this thing is just bomb. So I've come to love this even more than uh, queen cakes or um, what are they called? Muffins. Yes, they tend to be a little bit uh, crisp and uh, I just don't know. I prefer this one more than the normal uh, queen cake because I think the recipe is just the same as that one. The way you would uh, make a uh, cupcakes or queen cakes or uh, muffins but uh, this one is a little bit crisp so i loved love loved this my kids also enjoyed it i don't really need new friends so spend your time with me looking for someone who can play though wanna hang with me i'm not really looking for a friend so spend your time with me looking for someone not afraid of So repeat the same uh, for the whole butter until all of them are cooked. So the best thing about this is uh, they are extra soft and they take minimum time to cook. You can see they are cooked inside very well and they are kind of fluffy. So yes, it does not take a lot of time to cook this. It So hubby was all this time uh, on calls because he was working from home so yes uh, that's why you see him a lot of times uh, with his phone he was just working from home. So finally done uh, making them, they turned out uh, so great. The chances for them uh, burning or going bad is very minimal, especially if you just sprinkle the oil and be checking every once in a while. It is, it is just easy to make and I'm sure your kids are going to love it because my Ivana and Haley, they loved, loved this. They were asking about it even after we finished because... It could not stay for long. We just finished the same same day. Everyone was so so happy with the with this. I don't know what to call it. What can I call this? I don't know. But uh, we just try it out and then let me know how yours will turn out. So I called Habi to come and uh, do the testing. Well, because yes, he's always the tester in everything I cook. He's the first one to tell me how everything is. And uh, yet again, another uh, phone call for work. So I was there just waiting for him to finish so that he can come and uh, do the testing.
So all this time my Ivana was still sleeping. She had taken her breakfast. She woke up uh, quite early this day. I think at around 7.30 or 8. So she had to take another nap. So after taking, uh, after making the breakfast, I went to the bedroom to make uh, the bed and uh, also start uh, preparing myself because uh, we wanted to go out to do the shopping and also later on go for a dinner date. Maybe I shouldn't call you Or leave a message at all So I try to be patient Cause nothing's written on the wall Yeah, it's too soon to mention so once I was done, I hopped into the shower. So I'll be basically using uh, this uh, koji soap for my face and then this uh, Damomed uh, as a shower gel and then this uh, Femi wash. So I have a more detailed uh, shower routine. I'll link it down below if you'd like to know everything I use for my shower routine. So here is me brushing my teeth and then I will use this uh, rose water spray all over my face. I don't know why it's cut my head like that. guys i'm done preparing myself with hubby as well yes so we are all in black <laughs> we are all in black all black Yes, we are going uh, for shopping and then uh, after shopping, we are going on a coffee date. Yes, just to uh, spend a few hours and then we come home because it, it has been a minute. Yeah, it has not been a minute last yeah, weekend. Yeah, weekend, yeah, weekend. Yeah, so we want to step out. It's 
it looks very cloudy. It's, it's like it's going to rain. rain, but I shall still go. With the colors on the oh, baby, love me like you did last night. I wanna hold you till the morning comes. Oh, baby, love me like you did. Love me like you did. Oh, baby, kiss me till I see the light. Like you did last night. night. Like you did last night. night. It was a thirsty night. Baby, <laughs> let <laughs> What is wrong? Acha kuonyesha na mikono kuja hapa basi kando. Toa kwanza. Toa kando. Toa kaa hapa kando ni jione. Sijajio. Bebu na waste time. Jione na kio huko. Ni supu inanifanya na kaa sexualized. Sasa hizo zote venye ni makubwa. Kaa hivi nini mbaya. Uliona mtu nazo. Did you see someone with them? No. Huh? Did you see someone in them? Why are you so against them? He did not like the earrings at all at all. He was like, I will throw them away, I will hide them because he really did not like them. So yes, I ended up uh, wearing the ones that he had suggested. And uh yes, uh uh, this is the full outfit so i had to put uh, the camera in a, a vertical position so that you can see the whole outfit and uh, this is how he looked so i'm also guilty in uh, playing part on what he wears especially if i don't like a top or just something is off i really go deep and uh, tell him to not wear it or never wear it when i'm with him so i totally understand him and uh, yes this was the situation in my part he has never really loved those earrings but this time around he, li he really made sure I, I did not wear them So anytime uh, we are recording or I'm recording, my kids always love coming into the video. And this time Ivana was like, mom, I want to record with you. So I had to invite her to come and uh, just pause for the camera as uh, she tells us goodbye. In the spring, I just want your time. And uh, off we go. So I was basically just listening to music in the car.
So the weather turned out to be so sunny, it did not rain, it was not cold and yes I was so happy because I did not have to wear my jacket or uh, go around with the jacket. So we started off by going first to town to get some meat in the city market so that's where I basically get my meat in the city market they have so many stalls there you can uh, buy from uh, any of the stalls and they have a variety of meat from pork um, gizzards uh, chicken fish any type of meat you want they have it in that stall once we were done we went to the car for supermarket for the monthly shopping guys so we are done uh, shopping now we are headed to Siokimau what is it called Pride yes I think it's called uh, Pride I'm loving this uh, lip combo so I bought uh, this lipstick this one uh, this lipstick and then once I apply this one I top it up with uh, this uh, lifter gloss, the lifter gloss, the Maybelline lifter gloss. Then it gives this cachet which pops. Yes, I love it so much. So yes, we are kind of tired but uh, yes, let's go relax uh, at Pride Inn. It's a very nice place which I, I don't think Happy has never been there. Isn't it? Yes, Happy has never been there so I was there recently and I loved it. So. Let's uh, go there. Yes, also, I'm, I'm very due to do my nails. I was to do them today, but uh, because there were these commotions that were happening in town, the Mandamano, I kind of postponed it. But uh, then again, Happy told me we need to go shopping and do some stuff. He was bored the sitting in, in the house. So I think I'll do it next time. They, they've really survived. So I really need to go and do my nails. But yes, that's uh, for another day. Let's go to Siokimau. If I leave tonight, we could do this right. We'll find the remedy. Or would you stay with me now? So this was the place, uh, the Pride Inn in uh, Siokimau and it was so pretty, it was not crowded, we had to go to the upper side of it just to get the view and it was such a beautiful place though we went a little bit late because this was about I think 6.30 it was almost dark 
but uh, we enjoyed before uh, going inside because it was also getting a little bit chilly so yes it's in siokimau pride in it's called pride in the food there is also very affordable and uh, delicious so if you want to hang out somewhere you can try it out So we really had a great uh, date night though I was a little bit tired and I was so full that's why I was not even able to talk or do anything. I was so so full. So yes uh, we went home at around uh, 10 p.m. and uh, yes uh, I decided to do the shopping haul the next day because i was so exhausted to do anything we just prepared the meat with my house manager and put it away in the freezer so that they don't go bad and then uh, the next day i decided to do the shopping haul Home. I want to unpack the shopping. I'm not sure if I'll be able to show. So these are the food items uh, from the meat to the groceries. Everything we needed to stock up because I remember I had uh, done a bulk shopping the previous month. So most of the products were still there. I had to just uh, restock uh, the essentials or the items that usually uh deplete fast so for the freezer items i stocked up hot dogs some sausages i had already separated them and i uh, put them in the freezer some um, uh, smokies uh, nyama bites beef prawns and uh, yes these are all the meat products i got from a uh, city market minced meat uh maini or liver chicken drumsticks um some uh, beef cubes and uh yes uh, fish fillets i think those are all the things i bought and the uh chicken breasts yes chicken breasts so i usually separate them like this and also osubuko yes osubuko this is osubuko and this is a uh, fish uh, fillet so i usually separate them like this if uh uh, the space is not uh, too much I usually prefer using the papers the uh, sealed papers so for the shopping haul I have uh, tomato sauce some uh, oyster sauce pecan peel juice sodas I decided to take some alvaros for myself I stocked up some uh, spices that already finished I have um, uh 
this one is called tomato paste the tomato paste i usually use was not there i don't know what happened and i also stocked up the pizza sauce that uh, i'll show you in uh, my uh, future video on how to use the pizza sauce it comes so much in handy instead of uh, cooking your own pizza sauce i have uh, 10 kgs of maize flour some uh, kitchen towel i've stocked up also my wheat flour so because we usually cook a lot in this house with the baking and everything these are two types of uh, biscuits uh, so i had to put them in this jar and uh, yes uh, maziwa mala sugar rice um, some uh, chicken noodles uh some drinking chocolate and those are the things that were not there and also i had bought two uh two boxes of uh milk uh, the brookside milk because we usually consume a lot of milk in this house so on to the non-food items this is where i was uh, really stocking up and sp especially on my products my beauty products so most of the things here i got uh, from uh dubois or Duboa and uh, some I got from uh, Jumia so this is my first time using this mouth rinse it's uh, quite good because it does not have alcohol I had to restock a uh, body wash for my other bathroom and uh, also some body mist I have some uh, tissue here I've already opened uh, one pack I have some sunlight uh, restocking some um, Vaseline. I also had to buy my foundation. This was from Jumia, and also these uh, face masks because uh, they were also on offer. <coughs> Some uh, Rolon, and I also just found out that Pepsodent have uh, charcoal toothpaste. This is the first time trying it. Some sunscreen some uh, face blush this is uh, uh quite good i've used it and i love it also i usually love uh, restocking my eye pencils to last me a while i got also this uh, lifter gloss from uh, jumia and uh, this one is from dubois and uh, all this other good stuff i have all my makeup essentials restocked from uh, the compact uh, powder, eyeshadow, a highlighter, lashes, some brush, a face scrub, and I'm also trying this for the first time. This uh, face roller. I'll be showing you guys how I'm using it. It's much better than this one, but we'll see. I haven't used this one yet. I have uh, some uh, makeup brushes and uh yes uh, all these things uh i usually stock up every once in a while maybe twice a year or so because they will last you a long time so that is all the shopping uh, items i bought for this month because uh yes we really had uh things in stock still and before i forget i also had uh, bought this uh cutter is, is it a cutter yes a cutter a multi cutter it has several things inside and uh yes i loved it loved it loved it and uh yes i'll be using it in my kitchen and as i told you guys my hand uh, electric mixer was uh spoiled it has uh it had some issues so i had to get another one so there is the hand electric mixer i got from uh, jumia as well so and that's uh, basically it uh, for this video i hope you've watched it uh, till the end if you are new please do remember to subscribe and uh, join the family also do remember to follow me on instagram i'll put it on the screen and uh, yes that's basically it guys thank you so much and i'll see you on my next video bye